Aaron Man Amaze. <laughs> when you see four to five girls and one guy, it, it's hard to relate to it because honestly, if I was that guy with all them girls around me, I'd probably be a super pervert. My face would be in all types of damn vagina. Well, and actually, asses, apparently, at boobs. Well, actually, like I said before, okay, just like, which I've seen a few, okay, you know, you got Tenshi Muyo, you got Rosario Vampire, you got that crazy show Camphor, and I noticed something about, oh yeah, it's that other show that's on uh, Netflix, I forget the name of it, but, um... Sakurai! No, not, <laughs> no, well, that one, and also the one man with, with, with the angel demon thing, which they sort of, like, just threw away halfway through it, and I was like, oh, angel yeah, yeah. demon. Where basically the dude man had um, uh, was dating like um, uh, where he had a pick man between like the oh uh, the dime, oh d- uh, demon key dio oh yeah that no well, no wait, no no, no wait. it wasn't that it was some other show but I did like that one too I like that I like that one a lot because it did the harem anime right. I but, get to, or the thing is oh love Hina another one I the thing the thing is though it's just so much so much. Like, like, for instance, it'd be like the most lamest, loserish type guy to get all these girls to like him. It's just ridiculous. Actually, no. Like, a, it's like a, a damn no. nerd dream, man. Actually, no. Here's the thing. The reason why, man, the character is like that is it's supposed, another one. It's supposed to be because he's supposed to be the everyman, and I don't have a problem with him being the everyman. The problem that I have with it is that when you really think about it. The only real thing that's kind of holding this show together is the fact of all the fan service that they put them and they put around these women. And there are no other male characters to really like, like, um, uh, fill in the gap. And when they do put in other male, male char- characters, he will a dummy or a pervert. It's always like the one guy who can't have a conversation without saying something super perverted. Shami Zuki. Or more. Or most likely, he just kind of can't, um, or better yet, he can't function in real life without actually doing something fucking stupid. Which is, um... Which what anime will that? What that? Uh, self-work? Self-work? Self-work. That's what you were talking about. We got true be treated demon girl. And then, um... Uh, and a heavy girl. Self-work? Self-work? All right, it was an S. Some shit like that, but like um, um in the hat show, his best friend was one of these characters who basically could not talk to a girl without saying something super. super Nigga, great. look at look at my wife and uh, my and my actually, bride and a mermaid. That's another one. And um and um the girl was supposed to be like um I think she was like half human, half demon or some shit. And they both like like uh they the show made it very obvious that man they both like each other. Thing is, though, is that she just couldn't date him because he kept talking all weird, weird shit. And the weird, and the bad part about it is, is that he was the only male character there who actually, um, uh, aside from the main character, who had a name. And it was like, what the fuck is going on here? Man, it's a lot of anime is like that. You don't even know none of these motherfuckers' names. How, however, this is why I say. Demon King Dio is the show, aside from Ten Shimuyo, that actually did it right. Solely because in Demon King Dio, you um uh, you also meet a boy who turned out to be the Demon King because they told his future. And and uh, his one friend was this capable little guy who basically was he he uh, he wanted to be a hero. He wasn't all that he 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 wasn't all that strong, he wasn't all that great, but he had a good heart. And pretty much Halfway throughout the show, he became badass, and it was like, "Oh yeah, man, he's actually pretty cool." And there, are, and guess, and guess, and guess what? There are other male characters in the fucking school who do shit too. It's wonderful. Nah, nah, man, nah, man. It still has this whole thing of like, of like, they still focus more on the women because if you're gonna make a harem and um, um and they at least build out your cast to make them interesting, and all the women in this shit were pretty interesting and yeah, it's sassy too. And weren't trying, man, to be all, man, like, oh, yeah, man, what's our problem today? Well, yeah, man, there's a whole episode, man, about them traveling all around, man, this one city to get, like, a brand new shoe strap. It's, like, beautiful. That's... You know, that's, they never... You're right. They never actually see. have a good plot with these, Eber. That's what and I a man, And a male character can never seem to pick a girl. It's not about you picking a girl. It's mostly, like, about, like, look, let's be perfectly honest here. 
if they really made this show the way how man they wanted man to make it, he's fucking them all. So, so man, so basically we're kind of getting that out man way right. You now. know, people thought Mizuki was here on anime. You just look at the cover. Like I told he's you, he's surrounded you, by three girls. Like I told you before, when when you were making that cover, I told you before it was like. When, See, look. when you make the cover, it's Man actually... Man killed right here, and then you got three girls above him. I told you before when uh, you made that, or at least like when you were getting it made, I was like, it's been, it would be a good idea to put another male character, 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 character there just just to balance it out. You know what I mean? Because because everybody's mind goes there whenever they see it. But but I'm like... Hey, they thought that Sean was a chick. Actually, some motherfuckers did. Yeah, I know. But, um... He was, you know, boobs. I guess he a dyke then, apparently. Because he obviously dressing like a boy. But, but, uh, my thing is, though, is that, like, a lot of, a lot of those, they really don't have any really good plots to fill out the middle. Because most of the middle is just like, okay, yeah, man, we meet all of the characters, and after we meet the characters, it's always that gratuitous, um, swimsuit thing, and then after the swimsuit thing, it's um, and they good like fairy tale. I swear, every ten chapters there was a motherfucker like bow scene, a, a swimsuit scene, uh, somebody get a boob grab, somebody getting they ass max, somebody getting getting they panties put down. I'm okay with the fan service, but I'm like. Did you get that one picture? I think did Casey in that uh, picture with uh yeah. not you beat up uh uh yeah. er, or is it by mistake and she was down like face down doggy. You know, honestly, when I saw that because because when you because when because when you look at the one scene Look at three fifty five. When you look at the thing from out of from out of context, it looks like he just sort of just ran in um or ran into a room and there was like a lot of smoke and everybody was like, No, oh my god and then man he looked down and then a girl was just bent over in front of his penis. It was like, Oh, well, looks like I managed to sort of just you know, be, just break the girl. It was like, Oh, beautiful. To be honest with you, I was just stuck it in there. I mean at that point at the time you should got I thought I thought it was I thought I, it was hand time while I first seen that I shit. I thought it was solely because she had that look on her face and, and <laughs> And it was that look like... You know, you got to look at her head. She had not because he was like, I'll beat her ass. I'll beat them all up. He just went crazy and forgot that she was no, right there and no, tore her head up. No, no, no. It's the way she was bent over in front of them and how that shit... shit Did you see that drawn. arch that they drew in her back, though? Yes. And it was she like, had that bitch hyped the fuck up. And I was like, what the fuck, man, you, you just sent me? <laughs> I told her to send you that dumb shit. I don't see the whole chapter laying on tonight. However... However, like I said, most of these shows, whenever they do do this, they kind of really don't have to have anything to like balance out the middle. Because I said this before, it was like usually when they have animes like like that, you have a lot of interesting characters, and you have a and you have an every man main character, and you can like build some something around it. But they never do. They mostly just sort of just like just in, uh, they introduce all of the characters pretty early, like every like all the first episodes. And then afterwards, they have like a whole like seven episodes of nothing. And then the last few episodes. The last two or three like camera actually a have, plot progress. They have after. plot. Like I really had a problem with with, 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 with camper. I seriously had a problem with camper. And it wasn't because it was super fucking lesbonic to like to, 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 to basically the moon. I, I, that wasn't the problem. The problem that I had had with this fucking show was that nothing fucking happened in it. Nothing fucking happened because you can cut out like like basically like like 15 minutes out of every episode and only 5 minutes of content One happened. Minute. Yeah. That shit is fucking terrible. And I gotta avoid making my book because Mizuki somehow the new Mizuki have a lot of fan stories in it now. I realized what I was doing at least around the end, like around I think chapter. I thought I told y'all that shit, man. When ten, I was eleven, and twelve. I, chapter ten, eleven, and twelve. You were like the fuck. When I was writing in it, and I'm not looking over your shoulder. <laughs> for some reason, all this fan service just popped the fuck out of nowhere. I was like, I mean, it still got the plot possession, but I got come on. All them girls would be like walking goddess, and they say they walking cop teases. That what my friends call them. But anyway, you guys, tell what you guys think. Do you think that uh, hero anime is just like how we said it is? Or do y'all think otherwise? Make sure you rate, comment, and subscribe. People in the comments, save me from this 
from this weird shit that um uh, is on the internet. Please. Have a good one, you guys. <laughs> <laughs>